Well, 2017 is exciting to us because it's our 10th year in recognizing the top 10 new species. And during that decade, uh, nearly 200,000 new species have been discovered and named. Uh, and this would be nothing but good news were it not for the biodiversity crisis and the fact that we're actually losing species faster than we're discovering and naming them for the first time in history. And we now have increasing amounts of data that confirm that the rate of extinction is probably about a thousand times faster than in prehistory. I guess if I had to pick one this year, it'd probably be a katydid. Uh, that's remarkable in a couple ways. First, it looks very much like a leaf, and that's true of many katydids, but this one's especially detailed, vein-like structure of the leaves and so forth. And its hind legs are broad and flat and look like smaller leaves, but equally detailed. We want to draw attention to a couple things. One is the biodiversity crisis, the fact that we are losing species at an alarming rate, and that unless we do something to change our approach to conservation, we are on track to lose 70% or more of all the kinds of animals and plants in just 300 years. As the number of humans and our reach across the planet has increased, we are altering environments, we're destroying environments, we're polluting environments, and climate change, uh, with all the devastating uh, impacts it might have on our coastal cities and on our agriculture, no aspect of climate change is more threatening than accelerating species extinction because we can engineer our way through a lot of inconveniences of climate change, but only hundreds of millions of years will make it possible to repopulate the planet with biodiversity.